Okay, this video is going to show you just how to drain the water um, out of your filter here. Now, I'll stand back. It's kind of a little easier if I just start. So, this is a 2022 20, Peterbilt, uh, just the X15 Cummins. Most uh, filters are similar, but this is just how to drain the water. Uh, even though this is brand new, uh, my dash said to just drain the water out of your filter separator, okay? So if your dash says that, okay, I, I wish I had a towel, I'd clean it, but this is a brand new filter, believe it or not, but I got about 5,000 miles on. Um, and like I said, let me just start. Sometimes it's easier if I just stand back. Okay, on the Cummins X15, you can see where it's at right in the middle of my screen. Uh, what I do is I kind of, I turn my wheel to the right a little bit or to the left. That way you can get back here. Now, there's the filter. Now you see underneath. Okay, I'm gonna try to hold my cell phone and talk at the same time without my f dropping my phone. Okay, right here. Okay, right here. Okay, just study that and I'm gonna hold my phone up. Okay, do you see that lever? Okay, what you're gonna do is just twist it to the left. Okay, and you can see it's kind of sticking out. You know, the end of it is kind of at the nine o'clock position. You're just gonna turn it down to about the six o'clock position and then water will come out. And uh, so, all right, if I don't drop my phone, okay, right here, turn it to the left and that's all you do. And then turn it back and make sure to shut it off, okay? Now, whenever you drain water out of your filter, Okay, let's just say you got water somewhere up in here. Usually you can see it. Now, I already drained the water out, but let's say the water line is just right here. Now, water uh, weighs more than fuel. So water will come to the bottom and it'll sense that and your dashboard usually will say, just drain the water uh, from your filter separator. See the base right here? What I like to do, let's say the water level is about right here. Don't go below here, because if you do, you'll start draining your fuel out and the engine will shut off. Now, if you catch yourself in time, <laughs> just hurry and shut it off and turn your key and you might have to restart your engine two or three times, but don't do it all the way because you know what a nightmare it is to starve your engine of fuel. So, okay, so that's it. Hopefully this is as simple as a video can uh, be, but that's just how to drain your water. Sometimes you don't have to do it for a long time. And then sometimes you just have to, right now it's November when I'm filming this, I'm in Dallas right now. But for some reason, yeah, I only got about 4,000 miles, you know, on this X15 Cummins. And I already had a little bit of fuel, so, or water in my fuel filter, so. Okay, hopefully this helps. And once again, let me just go underneath and show you. So, you know, it's a real easy little lever. Just right there, just grab it, twist it to the left, and that's mostly fuel coming out, but it just comes right out the middle here. Be sure to snug it right back, twist it to the right, and you're good to go, and your engine should run killer. So, all right. Thanks for watching my videos. See you next one. Okay, bye.